Yeah, record them. Yo folks, welcome back to my channel. So, I have just seen our group for the Betfred Cup. And for the North section, Group B, we've got Dundee, Forfa, Athletic, Boro Rangers and Cove Rangers. Now, it's good good teams eh? I mean a few of them are we should we should win those games comfortably but you never know with these games you any team can be any team on their day um, but that that's our group for the Betfred Cup for the group stage and also I'll be doing a prior to this video I'll also be doing my preview game for the game tomorrow against Dundee United. Now two games two wins for us going into tomorrow's game on a high after being launched and on Saturday there. Now with Kevin Nesbitt off and running by scoring a hard trick and scoring a goal last week. He'll be on fire against hopefully Dundee United. Now, I mean, I wonder if Jack Cross will stay with the same team or mix it up. What, what do you guys think? I mean, I hope he stays with the same, maybe the young left back, Josh, Josh Dodge, um, maybe give, obviously put Louie in for that game because the young man Josh hasn't came up against the likes of Warren Shankland and you know, you know, those calibre of players. But, you know, so far, I mean, he's done not too bad in the left back role. I mean, absolutely, I can't fault the man. But, yeah, no, I mean, so far it's good for us to win two games on the bounce and hopefully go into the game and hopefully beat Dundee United now. My score prediction is Dundee United now Hibernian 3 and I'm going to say Kevin Nisbet hat trick. I'm calling it, no not hat trick, I'm calling it here for Kevin Nisbet first goal scorer. You've heard it here first. But I mean, yeah, it's, it's obviously good to be back doing videos from my channel. I mean, I know I was quiet for uh, like two and a half months while I was away, but now I'm back. Uh, yeah, there, there's, I've got a few videos up my sleeve and just Put, comment down below what videos you would like me to do. I visit maybe stadiums, obviously outside state of the stadiums. Uh, say I could do, yeah, or, I don't know, I mean, th this year, oh, well, Half of the year, should I say? But no, I'm I'm very close to six hundred subscribers, which I didn't really imagine to be in that this position. So uh, I just dance again, but 
And all of a sudden, when I was looking through the, obviously the bed fled cup groups did for us. We've obviously got. But no, I mean, so I also say the norm section. So group A, you've got hearts, m and cold and beef, ray flowers is five. For group B, it's Berlin, Dundee, four five, Philatic, Border Rangers, Cove Rangers. Group C, it's in Johnston, Dundee United, Pierhead, Brecon City, and Kelty Hearts. And in Group D, you've got Ross County, Arbroath, Elgin City, Stirling, Albion, Montrose. So, a few of them are quite, quite interesting groups. I mean, our group, we've, we've got easy opponent, but say that, it's, you know, but you never know what what you can what we can expect from these teams obviously Cove Rangers have done absolutely unreal this season last season. They done really good last season. But yeah it's, it's gonna be a a weird season this season. Hopefully fans get back into the into stadiums um, here in September time, whether or not that will happen needs to be seen. Uh, we need to just wait and, wait and see, but at least in a way we're going back to some sort of normality. But if, if you're new, please like, comment and turn on your notifications. Because, like I said, I'm on, the, I'm on my way to 600 subscribers. Hopefully, I can reach 1k either by the end of the year or by the start of 2021. But I'll see you guys later. I enjoy the rest of your day and enjoy listening to the game tomorrow. Obviously tomorrow night I'll be back with my usual match reaction, such and such. But for me, thank you for enjoying my content. Thank you. Done! Peace out, people.